Come on. Hey, Bob. that reminds me. Where's your spandex today? Did you lose it? No. No. You forgot you to bring took it, it back. Did I? You mm. need a sock down there. That's what it was. <laughs> <laughs> Right! <laughs> <laughs> moving swiftly on. <laughs> or a rub. <laughs> We're here with uh, Saints of Sin, who have recently been taken Dorset and Hampshire by storm. Uh, you've uh, you formed very recently, mm -hmm. and uh, you've played all over the place. Yeah. What happened? Where did it all come from? Where did it all come from? Well, uh, to start with, me, Marcus and Ash, we were in Mothership together. Yeah. And uh, we've known Matt from the push, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. And um, he actually did sound for us like for the last sort of summer with Mothership. So after that, us four all came together, mm -hmm. and we had we knew what we wanted to do. We were searching for like our perfect singer, and Brewery came <laughs> along. So he goes to my academy. So I mean, the perfect singer is how we say. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Almost. <laughs> Almost. Almost. He had to settle a little bit. Exactly. Yeah. What was the yeah. rumor about the, the original singer? Something, something happened to the original singer. Um, he, oh yeah. Oh, with the original singer. Yeah. Well, well he, basically, this guy auditioned to us first, and he, he was it. He was perfect. He was yeah. slightly below the perfect mark. <laughs> this guy was it. And uh, we played, I think, was it one gig with him? Like a small house party gig oh, or something? Yeah. And remember. then uh, was Ru Rui was at the party, and uh, he weren't having none of it. He, he, was, he wanted to be in the band, and he thought this guy was, what did you call him? A stumbling waste bag. <laughs> <laughs> so that's actually what he did. He put him in a waste bag uh, and killed and him. And he's gone. He's still in yeah. my car. All right, okay. So that's that's right. why it stinks. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's <laughs> touch my ass. <laughs> So you headline the join this, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, and how old are you? The young, young band, I'm, really. I'm the youngest. Seventeen, 17 yeah. to twenty. Five. Old man. Yeah. Old, yeah. And you've actually sold it out. So, so yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It was so, about two ten. How, how's that happened so early? What's what's going on? A lot of hard work. Yeah. yeah. I mean, one thing he does have over the old singer is he knows people. The other, the other guy's is there this for all his ex girlfriends coming to the gig? <laughs> no, that's all his sisters. We oh, his sisters. <laughs> yeah. That's why he's in the band. So <laughs> yeah, that was another plus. Great asset. Yeah, that joining this gig was our first kind of our first ever sort of headline. headline. Yeah, that was. Yeah. yeah, it was literally only a couple of months after we, you, you know, I was recruited. Yeah, we worked real hard. We, we loved the join as well. We heard, yeah, yeah, we heard they're having a bit of trouble as well, like it, it almost went like a uh, bust and stuff, so we thought we know we'd give most of the money that we earned from that gig to the joiners anyway, oh, yeah. so we really want to get lots of people to help them out as well. So. Place is Consider a sin to sin, we're charitable. We, <laughs> we made a, a That bit. doesn't mean we play for free. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we made a big proper hype video for that as well, advertising it, I think that really helped. So uh, thanks goes to uh, Brink Media for that one, I'm going to yeah. plug them in there. So the joiners... How was it? First first gig was was it perfect? Was that it, yeah, it was amazing. Pretty, yeah. pretty, pretty much. much. It was yeah. pretty much man. Amazing. Amazing. That was it, yeah. The crowd, the atmosphere. Yeah. yeah. Brilliant. Because there were lots of them too. They so were just the, jumping and like, eat. Oh, it was yeah, a day it was, it, was it was a night of fame. It, it, <laughs> yeah, it was yeah. a little taste of what it was. We've would got be a like. chant. It was our first yeah. stage gig and they were you know, we were held back a little bit before we went on stage and they were all saying it's off soon. <laughs> I think, everyone, I think everyone's <laughs> balls grew like two sides. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. well, I don't know about Josh's really. Yeah. So how do you answer the question, <laughs> if somebody would describe you as a, a Steel Panther tribute, how would mm. you put that? Who's Steel Panther? Who's Steel Panther, fair enough. What? <laughs> 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 so do you... Would you would you you say you take your influence from them or have you taken inspiration or sort of Justin Bieber? <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> yeah. 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 Like we, I was into all that hair metal and that sort of thing way before I knew about Steel Panther, and I love them because they have the same goal mm. as us. It's literally and like the uh, stage presence stuff like that we mm. love to take as well. Just be active and entertaining, just put on a show. Yeah, mm. yeah. Because you don't, you're pretty much ripping off your audience if they've paid money to come and see you you're stand there. Yeah. yeah, it's like we try and make give them a party. Yeah. Well, and it's that kind of aspect that's you know that's influential. But like, do, yeah, make it something exciting and party anthem. Yeah, 
I mean, Steel Panther are only like an exaggeration of what those bands used to be like anyway. They ne none of those bands took themselves seriously. They're all about, you know, just going out having a good time, not preaching to anyone, no, no politics bullshit, no whining about anything, <coughs> grunge. <laughs> <laughs> They're not Kurt Cobain either. Yeah. So, the other question uh, on, on everybody's lips is, all your hair real? Yes. Yeah. Everyone, no Mine, yeah. Mine's a wig. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he used to have long hair, but then he sort of like grew a vagina and cut his hair. <laughs> right, okay. Still got bigger balls than you. <laughs> well, we'll let the crotch cam decide about that. Yes, we will. <laughs> so, you, you do a few covers in this set, but from what I've seen, it's predominantly your own material yeah. as well. Yeah. You know, the and at the moment, the covers are sort of uh, just fillers, really, space fillers, until we have more time to write our own music. Cause like we said before, we haven't been going very long at all, so mm. we've had to sort of whip together all of these songs before our first gig. You know, and they're not throwaway fillers. Yeah. We, no. you know, we you change it up, we make it, you know. Mm. And I think from, from what I've seen, they're not obvious covers. Yeah. You know, you, you've selected them, you, 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 you can, you know, bring stuff in yeah. and think, oh, they do that. But, you know, mm. but you, your own material, you've got Living Young, One More Minute, you know, Born From Pieces, now that was a particularly interesting song, obviously mm. that sort of describes, you know, sort of bi biographical. I'm glad things. you got that. Yeah, because yeah, that's yeah. exactly sort of how we, how we wrote it, what we had in mind. What's it about? <laughs> <laughs> Not a strong writing force. Right? <laughs> yeah. He turns write. up and plays. <laughs> or read. He turns up and plays, yeah. Just how Wait, are we talking like music here or just standing? So who, who, who's, write, who's writing? Who's, is it a, it, a job for all of you? Or? It's, uh, well, a couple of songs, we're like all of us, yeah. but the main songwriters in the band are me and Josh. Yeah. Like, we'll come up with the, the, with the main idea and then sort of get everyone in, and then yeah. it will change a bit when people put their, you know, their own spin on things. But yeah, uh, everyone has a like. Then we haven't done one song where no one has when, said. Yeah, yeah, like everyone has put something in. Yeah. Into a song, so. But yeah. uh, living young, that was like the first song that we literally sort of wrote at a practice session. Yeah. Like Josh had an idea for a riff which he sang to us and then me and Matt like kept expanding on it and bouncing off each other and then we put like the harmony line on it and then we just kept building from there because everyone was getting ideas off each other mm -hmm. and that song was just like written literally by all of us sort of jamming so literally out. jamming in a rehearsal yeah. room yeah. and it yeah. just which is we've it never too. done that before really yeah. have we it was so good so, so you know some people write an acoustic guitar some you know yeah. all, all different things I think that's like how that. Steel Panther do it don't they yeah they, they do, do they? write on a guitar yeah we don't know and do you, do you have any plans to go into the studio to, to record album EP or oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we we're hoping August. Yeah. But yeah, don't let's not write that in stone. Yeah. Okay. yeah. But it's in yeah, the that, that, that's but the yeah, it needs a lot of stuff on the, the way. Mm. Yeah. We've so got a lot of material, bits. not alive, just to yeah. all your own stuff yeah. to, to get you out there. Definitely. And there, there isn't there's a, there's a member of the band that's not really here that's sort of behind you all. There's a, a chap called Gordon, I understand. <laughs> oh, yeah. We should bring him in. We should bring him in. Let's bring in Gordon. <laughs> this is... Um, Josh, we can move him. This is Gordon's best manager. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I suppose almost the unsung hero of the band. Yeah. 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 This guy <laughs> these guys has probably. worked really hard untirelessly to, mm, to get you gigs. Yeah. Mm. His phone bill must be ridiculous as well. Yeah, he, and he pies just as hard. hard. He pies just as hard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes. He gets the best tips. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, Gordon, what, what's it about these guys? Tell, tell us a little bit. Why, why, why are you so inspired by I think... Apart from one being your son, I understand. <laughs> but I, I don't bring that into account, really. I think it's They're the, all your kids. <laughs> exactly, I do. Yeah, I treat them all like the, my, my lads. Um, yeah. It's the passion and the commitment they've got. I mean, obviously, they've all been in bands before. And I've experienced it where they've all had other things that are priority to the band, whereas these guys literally live it and they want it to work and they're, they're committed 100%. And if anything happens and they, they, you know, it takes off tomorrow, they're all prepared to drop everything yeah. and go for it. Mm. And that's what I love about them. They've got 100% passion and commitment, to be honest. Yeah, I think you. seeing them on stage, you know, they, you, you, you really look like you enjoy it. You know, mm. that's, that's the yeah. thing. And you, you, can, you can pretend to enjoy it, yeah. And it doesn't come across. Yeah, but when, yeah. you, when you're passionate about mm -hmm. something and Definitely. and you put your all into it, mm -hmm. it's uh, it's pretty amazing. Yeah. So, 
What, where, where do you want to go? Where, where, where do you guys want to go? You know, what, what's the, the plans for the behaviour? Very top. KFC. KFC. Yeah, just stop it there on the way. Hopefully the very top, but <laughs> the, yeah, yeah, the top. we'll just Good keep gigging, keep, keep plugging it, and hopefully we'll get picked up, you never know. Mm. But, uh, Good following. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's broadening our horizons now. And sort yeah. of the thing is, areas if and I could quit my job, and I'll just constantly do this all my life, and I'll make a bit of pennies out of it, and like make sure everyone has a good party, then I'll, I'm, I'll be happy. Mm. Exactly. Yeah. Same. Mm. Sold. Yeah. Done. <laughs> we're all the same. Yeah. Yeah. I'll take that. Yeah. We're, we're hoping for more. Yeah. <laughs> if you have a time machine, okay. and you could go anywhere you like, <laughs> maybe a gig, maybe back to a time in your life, where would oh, you go? Yeah. Quick, we'll start with Gordon. <laughs> I can't think off the top of my head, to be honest. I'm talking about Green Day, the yeah. O2, I'd love to see them there. Yeah. That's, that's, I'd yeah, love to that. go for that, definitely. Okay. Obviously, I'd want to go back to the 80s and then see like the original Van Halen and stuff like that. It'd yeah. be sick. Poison Motley Crew, all yeah. that sort of thing, mm, all back of them. in the day. Yeah. I'd, I'd echo him, take me back just before the 80s. I can brace for it all. <laughs> yeah, get ready for it all. <laughs> and then as it comes, I'd learn it all. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'd, yeah. I'd, I'd follow it around as it happens. Uh, yeah, that'd be me. I'd take a bag, go to the 60s, fill it with drugs. <laughs> <laughs> and then end up meeting them in the 80s. <laughs> yes. You wouldn't remember where you'd come from. <laughs> Sparky, come on. Uh, I reckon my answer's probably going to surprise you, because um, you probably expect an 80s, right? No. <laughs> I don't know what we're expecting. Go on. Pirate times. I want to be a pirate. <laughs> pirate. You want to be a Jack yeah, Sparrow? I, yeah, yeah, I'd go back and be on a pirate ship and fuck shit up. Mincing around. Raping and pillaging. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Steve Rockin does that now. <laughs> nope. Come in. Uh, probably yesterday, I had to kill a milkshake. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Oh, yeah, that should be milkshake. That was pretty good. Nah, I'll be back, back to the 80s on the Sunset Strip. Yeah. 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 So no one wants to be on my pirate ship. Nah. I see yeah. how that is. <laughs> there, Gordon, there's a seat for you there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we've lost the lead guitar. Right? No, I'm back. Don't worry, we've got one of them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, it's an absolute pleasure to have the chance to have a chat with you and uh, sort of help promote yeah, the, thank you. Uh, the message that it's saying to send. Long may your success continue. And we yeah. look forward to seeing you playing in uh, just a while. Awesome. awesome. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you. Very much. Thank you.